One out of 40 people in the U.S. experience a fracture every year. My research is focusing on how we can repair bone faster and better. Here we're seeing an intact shin bone, or the tibia, that's being rotated 360 degrees, and it's been scanned using a CAT scan technology called microcomputed tomography. At day 10, following fracture, we see the fracture line here, and callus that's formed on this bone is outlined in green. So the green represents the new bone that's formed 10 days following the fracture. By day 20, we can see that the callus has increased drastically in size, surrounding the fracture site now, and it's providing stability and the healing environment that's needed for the fracture. By day 40, the bone has almost completely healed the fracture, but the bone is still somewhat immature. The bone is not the same quality as the intact tibia. The callus is still present, but it's much smaller and it's become more consolidated. If we look at a non-union situation, the red arrow is highlighting a gap where the bone hasn't healed, and callus has formed both above and below the fracture line, and highlighted in green and orange uh, specifically, but that bone is not healed. So the aim of our research is to be able to deliver therapeutics to that injury site that will repair that bone.